Hello folks, and welcome to another episode of Pokemon Lovers. Today, we are going to talk about the impressive new Z bracelet with the little Z crystals. As you can see, I have some on the sides here. Now, the first one we have in here is obviously the fire crystal, which is one of my favorites, uh, which is one of my favorites because I have a Pokemon to use it with. So the f one of the first things you'll see on this band is this little strap in the center here. This little strap is to if you have smaller wrists, like I tend to do on this band, it works with little kids all the way up to big kids. So it says ages 4 and up, so it will work with big, big wrists, because if you can see, over here on this side, you can see how how if you just take it like this, boing, it'll pop open. The other side just looks like this, you can't pop it open, it just kind of like hinge, see? So as you take it, you pop it open, you make sure that this is pointing forward, kind of put your hand in there, pop it in, boom. See, and it's really big on my wrist because it can slide in and out like this. It's like really big. See? It's really big. So now we're going to show you some of the cool features. So, one of the cool features to note is over here, see how it has on the side here? It has the like lines. So the big line in the center there, if I can kind of focus in, Big line on the center there, the line over here to the to the left on this side is going to be for the DS mode. The line, the big line in the middle on the top here is going to be for the trial mode. And then the two lines over here on the left hand side on this side are going to be for if you want to just play around with it, pretend. Pretend mode, basically play mode is what I call it. So we can put on whatever mode we like. Um, let's see, I'll give you an example. So the, So this mode just does this. That's all it does. The middle mode, which is the trial mode, which is what you would find if you were to like go to the store and actually um, buy this thing. And bef before you pay take it out of the package, you could actually hit the button and it would make some sounds. And now this is what it sounds like if you were to before you were to open it. See, it's kind of boring because the crystal on the inside doesn't light up. Now, if we go all the way over to the play mode, we can... It's pretty cool. So, now, we'll show you some of the other crystals that I have. So, that was just a fire crystal. So, if you hit up top here, we have this little, tiny, little button right there where my finger's hitting. You just snap that, ready? You hear a little snap. And then you kind of just pull it out. And as you can see on the crystals themselves, right there in the little crystal down here at the bottom, it has a little arrow, which shows you exactly which way it's supposed to go in. Now, we're going to show you... That's the grass. Now, we're going to pop this one out, and we're going to show you the water one. Now, same thing, you press this button, pop it out, kind of just grab it out. Now, we're going to show you poison type. Now press the button. Now I press the same thing, pop it out. And just grab it out of there. Now we I'm gonna show you the steel one. That's pretty cool now. Then you same thing, you hit the button, pop it out. Then we are going to show you the last one I have, which is the rock one. Yeah. 
yeah, so those are the crystals, and that's all the crystals that I have. So I'm going to, first of all, I'm going to pop them back out and grab the water one, because the water one's my favorite one, which is the, see? And it does the cool little, like, light up sounds again. Now what's cool about this is on the sides, you can see how they have the little notches on the sides. They're right up here. This the, the first one right here is where the actual arrow goes. So now, as you can see, you would pop it right in there. Boom. Once you get it in there, you can see how the arrow's up top here. Bing, bang, boom. And then the crystal's in there. And these are nice because you pop them in and they literally don't come off. So you ready? So now let's try the next one. I'm going to put the arrow up top like we did before. You literally, listen. That's because we're snapping them in because they literally snap in and they don't come out. So now we're going to do the same thing for the next ones. And that's how you pretty much snap the crystals in and they stay in pretty well. Now, the next thing to know is if you want to change your battery. So the quickest way to change them is to open it up. Inside here, you can see how it has a little screw right over here on the side. You basically unscrew that, put some batteries in, and away you go. Now this, I'm pretty sure, it takes. looks like it's going to take some AAAs. Um, it doesn't really say on the band itself. You have to open it to find out. I'm pretty sure it takes about two to three AAA batteries to require this. Um, oh, see, there it goes. Just kind of activated itself. Fun. Well, now we're going to show you exactly what it does on the DS. Alrighty, folks. So I'm back here again. going to actually show you how this crystal, this little bracelet, actually works with the blue crystal in it at first. So, as you can see here, I have Pokemon Sun. There's a little icon for it. So if we click the little icon, it'll launch right into the game. Now, this might, it might be a little hard to see the picture because only because I'm trying to show you the bracelet and the DS at the same time. So, let's get in here. As you can see, I have most of the crystals. I ended up um, getting all the way to the Elite Four in this game and never beating the Elite Four yet. I can still do it, I just haven't because I haven't trained on my Pokemon good enough, good enough yet. So, let's go. So now that we're in the game, we're going to press the X button. You can see all my, you can see the box and the badge. Now we're going to just check out my Pokemon. Let's press the first button. As you can see, we have Gyarados on there as first. He's one of my favorite Pokemon. I get him every single time that we play the game. Now, oh, we got to press B again. Now we can just move around until we get into battle. All right. So now we're going to have to zoom out a little bit just so we get the full picture. Oh. This Pokemon, we're going to fight this guy. Gyarados is going to fight this. I love when Gyarados comes in, because Gyarados automatically lowers your attack. See? Attack fell automatically. Now, as you can see here, we have the, the band right here, and my DS right here. Now, over here, you can see how we have the fight button. We're going to click the fight button. Now, you can see how it says right here, how we have the Z crystal button. We're going to click the Z, or the Z power button, excuse me. We're going to click that button, but as we do, watch watch the band. Oh, did you see the band light up? That was pretty cool, right? Because it does that every time, just to let you know it's got it. Now, if we hit the button, one of, one of them, let's see the band activate. And as you can see, that was an instant death. All right. Now we're gonna show you. We're gonna show you the next crystals. We'll we'll be right back. Alrighty, folks. We're back. We're using my starter Pokemon, Incinerator, and we are going to use the Red Crystal. And we're gonna show you how this is a little bit different than the one you just saw with my Gyarados, because each Pokemon in each crystal they do different things depending on the Pokemon. So now we're gonna back out of here. And we're going to get out of that corny menu. Now we're just going to run around until we find a Pokemon. Oh, there we go. Let's see what we're fighting. 
this guy again. All right, so let's go, and we're gonna do the same thing as we did before. We are going to click here, and then click the Z power. But watch the bracelet at the same time. See, it detected it. Now we're gonna hit. We can either hit the A button or the screen. We'll hit the screen. All right, that was another inst insta death. So now what we're gonna do is we're just gonna come down here, press the X button, press the save button, keep pressing the A button until it's all saved. Then we're gonna hold, then there's a little power button down here, we're gonna hold it. It's gonna show my little DS here, we're gonna hit the button, and that's done. So yeah, so hello folks, I just wanted to show you this little Z bracelet and what it's so, you know, what it actually does. Because some people of you have been thought about getting it, you know, I thought about getting it for the longest time. But right now is a great deal because as far as I know, at Target is where I bought mine. They have a deal where you buy it for $24 and you get the bracelet and you get the red, the green, and the blue crystal to start with. Then I bought another pack, one these ones, one, two, three. I bought those in a pack for about $5.99. And it was cool because I can use those too, you know, on the band. Um, yeah, so if you would, please, guys, down in the comments below, down in the comments below, we are going to put our Facebook page and our Twitter page. If you would, please go and like those. And, and then over here in the top, over here in the corner, over here, folks, on the screen, you can see a little button that says subscribe. Please subscribe to our channel. It really helps us out by making videos. And down in the, down in the comments where we're going to put our social media, we also have a new shop where you guys can buy cards like this now we're gonna have cool cards like this we'll put a link down in the description for you guys so yeah just if you could like subscribe comment come and watch your social media accounts all that good stuff and we'll see you in the next video